All right, so someone on Twitter actually sent me the link to this article, but it's not the article that I wanted, but I found another one that really interests me. So, looks like Mortal Kombat 2 has found this Johnny Cage actor. Now, I don't know about this guy, but I heard that he was from The Boys and Star Trek Into Darkness. But, in my opinion, I'm a little unsure how I feel about it because they should have just cast that Alan Mousy as Johnny Cage because he was the perfect choice for the character because have you seen the Kickbox reboot? There were two prequels of it. But if you watch those movies, I think you will know that Alan Mousy is the perfect candidate for the character Johnny Cage, in my opinion though. But uh I don't know how I feel about I trust Todd Garner and I trust Ed Boomerang. I just want him to give it his best to play the iconic character as long as he doesn't mess up because Johnny Cage is a fan favorite character from Mortal Kombat and the last thing you want to do is hire someone with no experience with Mortal Kombat who knows nothing about Johnny Cage. If they have the martial arts skills, then I'll give them a shot. That's just how I feel. So let's take a look at this article. The 2021 reboot of Mortal Kombat, which is viewable with HBO Max subscription, includes some of the heaviest hitters from the video game franchise, including Raining, Sonya Blade, Liu Kang, and Sub-Zero. However, one notable name missing from the lineup was Hollywood star Johnny Cage, with screenwriter Greg Russo explaining that the character was left out because the movie already featured Josh Lawson's Kano. However, with the Mortal Kombat 2 set to begin filming soon, which is next month, it's been revealed which actor is being lined up to play Johnny Cage in this continuity. According to the rap, Carl Urban is in final talks to star in a sequel as Johnny Cage, who was teased at the end of Mortal Kombat 2021 through a movie poster for Citizen Cage. Assuming a deal is reached, this will also be the first new actor to be brought aboard Mortal Kombat 2, although officially speaking, the returning players from the first movie haven't been unveiled yet. Okay, so to be fair... You know, he is one of the third actors to play the character, but the question is, how is it going to play out when we see a teaser, an official trailer behind the scenes of him doing martial arts training to play Johnny Cage? Does he know the character? Because I think when it comes to Johnny Cage fans, they want to make sure that the character is faithful to the source material to play the iconic character. But I've heard of him starring in The Boys and... Star Trek Into the Darkness or something like that. I'm not sure, but they might have some new information in this article, so let's continue. Carl Urban, of course, is a man who knows his way around Jannar content from playing Dr. Leonard McCoy in the Kevin Timeline set Star Trek movies to leaning 2012's Dread as his anonymous protagonist to appearing in Thor Ragnar as Scourge the Exener. I guess if that's how you say it. These days, he's arguably best known for playing Billy Butcher in The Boys, the superhero series Amazon Prime video subscribers have easy access to, but he was also her last year as Jacob Holland in the Academy Award-nominated Netflix film The Sea Beast. Oh. I think what I need to do is do my own research on the actor on The Boys to see if he has any good performances or not. Just so that I can be able to understand why he was in final talks of playing Johnny Cage. Nah, so I think that's what I need to do is just do some bit of like research before I actually make videos on because I really don't know nothing about him to be honest with you. But honestly, in my honest opinion, I still would prefer Scott Atkins. No, not Scott Atkins, but um Ala Mousy to play Johnny Cage because he is the perfect fit in my opinion. So I'm not gonna stop saying until they get it. I don't know. Since no plot details for Mortal Kombat 2 has been revealed yet, we have no idea yet how Johnny Cage, whether he's played by Urban or someone else, will fit into the story beyond being one of the protagonists recruited to protect Earthrealm from the villains who surfaced this time around. Still, there are quite a few facts one should know about Johnny Cage going in the sequel and the screenwriter, German Slayer, he said he was looking to do a definite version of the character. Josh Hornet also one express interest in play Johnny Cage, but eventually the filmmakers decided to go in a different direction. 
So you got multiple actors who is looking to play the character. Scott Atkins, Al Mousy, Carl Urban. Then you got Josh Hornet. And I know there were some people that wanted the Miz and Cody Rhodes to play John Cage, but we don't need wrestlers to play martial artists in Mortal Kombat. Yes, the Miz has a personality of Johnny Cage, but that doesn't mean that he should play the character. Heck, Cody Rhodes, a while back on Twitter, stated that if they made a Mortal Kombat movie, they should cast him as Johnny Cage, but I really don't think that's the case. You know, give martial artists a chance to play the characters instead of Wrestlers doesn't make any sense. Simon McQuay is returning to direct Mortal Kombat 2, and it's rumored that the sequel's owner new characters will include Shell Khan, Baraka, Katana, Quan Shi, and Sindel. Should any of these people, as well known as Carl Urban's casting, are confirmed? Yep, okay, you know what? Here's the part that's really interesting to me Quan Shi. They did a live action of Quan Shi in. Mortal Kombat Mythology, Sub-Zero, that was horrible. But, it wouldn't surprise me if they get someone like Chaney Tatum to play Quan Shin, or someone else who was young or even older in the mid-40s to play the character. Because Quan Shin is the oldest, you know, missionaries in Mortal Kombat. But, um, yeah, man, this is an interesting read. This is an interesting article. Um, if y'all want the article, the link will be in the description. But like I said, shout out to the person who sent me the article on Twitter. I didn't like that article because I couldn't really understand certain words. But I think when it comes to this article, it gave me a bit of information that I need on who is Carl Urban. So it makes sense. And hopefully Simon learns from his mistakes in the previous film about the jump cuts and the quick edits that can pretty much ruin the fight scenes in the martial arts movies based on a video game. So, at least you got the Moon Knight writer and the director. Now, like I said, if he's in final talks of being the official cast member of Johnny Cage, I wish him nothing but the best. But I still would have preferred Alan Mousy as Johnny Cage. That's just how I feel. Feel free to disagree with me or not. I'm just saying. So, like I said, if you want the article, the link will be in the description. So, I'm going to holler at y'all in my other video.